Hi, I'm Pete and welcome to Just a Few Acres Farm. Well, today is the true test of the MD. It's about 85 degrees out. The breeze has kicked up, which is awesome for drying hay. And I'm going to use this four-star tether behind the MD that I bought at auction a few months. This auction right here. I cut this hay yesterday afternoon and so it's been down for about 24 hours. Usually I'll pet it first thing in the morning the day after I cut it but I wanted to get the out of their field cut. It's already drying on the top quite a bit. Underneath though is really wet and green. I always pet hay as early as I can get it spread out so that I have less loss from shatter from tetting. Well let's give it a try. bog down with this but the MD acts like it's barely there. I mean it's just a little long really. Hey why don't envelopes reproduce? They're all male. That's a bad one. Enough of this putt putting along. Time to gas her up. Her diesel are up, I guess I should say. This wind in 85 degrees is going to dry this out awful fast. I hope I can bail tomorrow maybe. Almost got this field done. Quite a difference after you tet it. Spreads it all out really evenly. Well, here's one field done. Somebody mentioned a few videos ago when I cut this field to have a contest to guess how many bales will come off of this field. Well, I'll let you know, this is about a five acre field and I make five by five bales that are kind of loose. It's an old round baler. If you guess the right number, closest to the right number without going over Bob Barker rules here, I'll name one of the piglets after you. How's that? Put your guesses in the comments down below. You know, now that I think about it, naming a piglet after someone, probably isn't the highest honor. So if you've got an idea for what the prize should be, put that down in the comments below. This wheel just keeps plugging up and it's only this wheel 
that gets wound up with grass. I don't know why. All right, got that fixed. Let's get to doing this second field. This is the field I cut this morning. That first field was too dry to my liking for cutting, but I made a decision this morning to get this field cut so it had maximum dry time and to put off petting the other field. This field will be better tedding because it's wetter. running this rig because I haven't worked the MD since the rebuild so I'm listening for all kinds of things on that and I'm learning what's normal for its operation and then I got this thing behind me that I've never run before and I'm doing the same thing for that so it means a lot of paying attention. The old girl ran great. It took me, um, I don't know, about three hours. Probably could have done it quicker if I wasn't filming, but about three hours of run time for this and no major problems. She really ran nice, nicer as we went on, it seemed like. Tomorrow, hopefully, if this weather keeps up, I'll be making 48 hour first cutting hay, which is not common around here. Bail 48 hours after cut. We'll rake it up and bail it. I'll have to check it and see, but hopefully I'll be seeing you tomorrow with another video. Have a great day.